Alright guys, yeah, last night we went to see Alien Rhymeless and I just thought I'd like just give a quick sort of quick, quick review on it. Like I'm a big fan, massive, massive fan of like the Aliens franchise. Absolutely love Aliens. The first one in Aliens 2 is my favourite movie of all time. I absolutely love Aliens. Have, have it on um, on a DVD, DVD like a mini and I uh, highly recommend this this comic here, it's called Aliens Essential. Essential for essential uh, comics in volume one. This is really cool. They did they did like a predator version of it as well. But um, I just I love the art the artwork in it. That's really really cool artwork. There's a back like they did they did some coming in fire like um, really cool artwork. It's just a different style like for an aliens fan. Definitely definitely highly recommend checking this out. I also have that. Um, I've got the aliens comics actually. There's a few back there as well. Over there, took the way over there somewhere. This is really cool. This, this HR Guide or Art Club. I like it. Really, I highly recommend checking this book out if you get a chance. Like, you know, the originally designed Alien. Um, really, highly, highly recommend, recommend it. This, this artist, this artist is unbelievable. Really different, really out there kind of stuff. Like, airbrush kind of stuff. It does some sketches as well. Um, some highly detailed. Airbrush one, like, but this is a really, really great book. I highly recommend it. It's by Tan, um, Tashjen, Tashjen. Well, but, um, yeah, if you didn't get a chance to go, to go, to go and see the movie, definitely, definitely go and check it out and come back here later and just hear what I've got about it. Yeah, I really, really enjoyed this movie. Um, definitely ranks up really, really high. I'm going to say it's like, that's sort of been abandoned like I love that like really reminds of Dead Space the game Dead Space I don't know I don't know if you ever checked it out yourself Dead Space but um, um, you know it has a zero G G element to it and then it has like um, um, environments the high industrial sort of power environments Fair warning, and definitely check this movie out if you get a chance and then, and then come back. Just, just hit you to think about it, really appreciate it. But then, um, um, definitely, definitely consider subscribing to the channel if you like this kind of content. Hit that like button as well if you like the like this content as well. But um, I, I liked Android, Android um, was, re was really cool in it. I thought it was brilliant seeing the um. The original Android from Aliens 1. I wasn't expecting that. It was like a corpse on the ground, and, and like you, you could tell he was an Android. But the, the kids that were there, they weren't. They didn't really respect Androids like that. They didn't really see them as humans. You know, it worked really well. But they wanted a chip from his from his neck because uh, they wanted information on his. I, I, talk, 
my tata and did that jam. The, the, the aliens were good. It, you know, uh, it reminded me of aliens because there was like a shooting gallery bit where it was like the girl and the android and they were trying to get the lift as well. The lift, you know, they waiting for the lift. And then um, the aliens were coming along. She has the pulse rifle. It's like a sort of new version of the pulse rifle. She's like shooting them all down. So, you know, I, I love that. I just, I just had a really good fun. Of the gravity and all, all this, um, all their like, um, because they're afraid of the acid, you know. But I, 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 lo I love that I, little things like the TVs, like the TV screens are all these sort of like old, sort of like, you know, CRTV monitors, you know, with like scan lines and stuff. I just love all that. I love all that. I love that, that, that like, um, you know, like Star Wars tried to do that as well. We're, we're, let's set the future, but everything is pristine, everything's like broken, and like, you know, lived in. Dirty, filthy, and like not working correctly. So I, I, I love all that. It just adds the atmosphere of it. And like, you know, uh, yeah, the android was really good from the original movie. And he's trying to, he's trying to tell them he has a, he has a new directive for the company to, um, you know, preserve the aliens at all costs. And um, just really, really enjoyed, really enjoyed it. Like, um, you yeah, the sound. Line, has a line from the old film, you know, and the end where, 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 where the android is like taking down the babies to protect the girl and the girl. It's like, get away from her. You know, like from the, from the first movie, but you know, it was, um, you know, I, I thought it was really well done. It wasn't like taking it so seriously, I mean, it was just like put in there. Yeah. I like the, the movie to allow. I, I thought it was great, was that like. And then it's a lab, you know, the Android has a chip change, so it gets a new part of the company or whatever. So it has a sort of easy intention, it's going to go and in the lab you develop this new seer of this whole thing helps you, helps you work and then to bring you back to death and stuff like that. Like, there's a shot like that and then you kill the bad boy. You give the seer the serums, the rats will regenerate and go back to normal. Like, oh, this stuff is this great, we can use this, but. Of course, there's this unseen footage that they show later of the rats sort of beyond that part, of, like the rats flying within the past, and um, so, uh, you know, it goes beyond this genetics, turns into an alien itself, and then you have the shot of like the the, the tame or whatever with the rat, and it's like like a dead thing, but it's like coming out of the uh, it's uh, like pod whatever, it's just like this mad looking thing, like, I was like, oh my god. The girl, the girl was taken down by one of the aliens, and they, they gave her the serum. They tell her to go back to the back to the ship, but of course she takes the serum and then she's in a car and another job. But the crazy bit, this is the crazy bit. The end is like she, she gives birth to this crazy baby alien. The alien, the alien is a big monster. I like it. It's so loud, crazy, not hurt the aliens. You know, the aliens are their own. I like that distinction, it's almost full on horror. I wasn't expecting that. Like, there's truly like crazy jump, jump moments of this. Like, the little guys, the little, the little face hoggers, you know, them running down the, the hallway, like, the, you know, like really good. I, I, I'm telling you, this, this film uh, ranks highly. I, I really enjoyed this, really enjoyed this. Like, and I know it's like, like have a new cover, to have this new VHS cover, and that looks really, really good. Cool. I'm definitely gonna. I really enjoyed this movie. I really enjoyed this movie. It's very good. I, I know it does have the cliche of the girl boss at the end, the girl survived to save the day. But I still think I'm okay with that. You know, in certain instances, I'm okay with that. Like, you know, if it was a bloke, if it was one of the blokes at the end, you know, swap her out with a bloke. You know, and, you know fair enough. Fair enough. You know, uh, I don't think they do that because. So get my point there, you know, just swap my rifle and go. The blokes are kind of bad as well. They get killed off, but I have to pay for it. I mean, for them. Yeah, I really enjoy it. She's great after the movie. I mean, I just I end up liking the characters. I end up caring for the, uh, for the, uh, the android. Uh, that was a really cool moment in this 
sweet for the moment. Yeah, I, lo I love that they're in the ship and the guys, the guy is, uh, they're trying to get away from the, uh, the Android, the old Android from the first one. He's like, uh, he's like being, being on this tomorrow, he's like, I'm your friend, let me take over the ship and I'll, I'll help you out. And obviously, he's a sinister intention. These are just my quick thoughts. Um, generally really enjoyed it, music's fantastic, sound design's really really cool, I was in the Dolphin Theatre it's really, and it's just amazing, really really cool, like really cool jump scenes in it. Um, and I mean, obviously you can probably nitpick it and stuff, but I kind of just... Um, maybe that, that, that makes me their perfect, perfect audience, I'm just like a happy edge, you know, just, just enjoy just enjoy what I'm giving. I could probably pick it, pick it apart. Maybe I feel differently about it yeah, down the line, but right away I just think I think it's great, yeah. At the end, yeah, the baby goes into this mad, like, yeah, human figure to the type thing. It's like, yeah. Oh, the shots of space are really cool. There's like this ring, this, um, you know, the space station is going down, and it, 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 what would you call it? It's, it's like the it's like the rings of Saturn. There's like the, it's like a an asteroid belt, an asteroid belt. And it's moving, moving rapidly, and the ships are kind of going into it, and it's destroying absolutely everything. There's a really cool shot of like the main character at the end trying to get rid of this new, this new horrific uh, creature. And it's a really cool epic, wide shot of space and stuff like that. And really cool moments of like, where they're, they're trying to get rid of this planet, trying to get off the planet. Like, you know, there's no sun, they don't have sun because of the clouds and, and the light and stuff like that. But they sort of they take this pod and try and get up to the silver ship to, to, to go to this new place. They go through the ozone layer, and they're out in space, and there's this kind of shot of the sun, and they all sort of light up the girls and look at the sun. Just really cool shots of that, really cool cinematography, with incredible sound design, incredible sound cinematography. And I like how everything looks, the space look, it just has the aliens vibe, has the aliens in. Homage to the old style, it has its own, has its own feeling, it has its own style. I really, really love to put in. These are just my quick thoughts. Again, I hope you enjoyed the video.